Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're doing another UKM2 question using the MoMAP method. So this is the question. A football shrine is made by sewing together 12 black pentagonal panels and 20 white hexagonal panels. There is a join wherever two panels meet along an edge. How many joins are there? So, uh, making a mind map of this, you have um, a football which has 12... Well, we don't need to know they're black, but we can just say pentagons. Basically, 12 pentagons and 20 hexagons. And then there is a join whenever the panels meet. And where, yeah, so how many joins are there, basically? So we can list all the joins there could be in this um, football. So we have a join with a pentagon side and a hexagonal side and then you also have an hex a white hexagon meeting a white hexagon too and um, there is a join there as well so we know that the pentagon never touches any other pentagon so we can um figure out how many joins there are between the pentagon and the hexagon by just doing 12 times the um times um, the five sides of a pentagon. Sorry, just good. So you have, which is 60, so um, 12 times five, which is 60. So that's how many joins there are with the, uh, the pentagon and a hexagon, or the pentagons and the hexagons. Now for the hexagons and the hexagons, it's a bit more complicated. So if you draw a uh, hypothetical hexagon in this, and then we have our a, pent a black pentagon here, and then our pentagon here again and then here again and then we have our hexagon here hexagon here and hexagon here so that's a hexagon and these are pentagons we've already counted the joint all the joints there are with pentagons and hexagons so we have to basically leave these out and then we have our hexagons here so if we were to include our pentagons and do a whole um, all the joints together we reduce 20 times 20 times uh, 6 for how many sides there are which are 120 joins however we we took out all the pentagon joins so really what is left is 120 minus 60 which is 60 so 60 60 of the joins there are between each here with all these hexagons however some of these joins are um, double counted because if we have hexagon one here and hexagon two here these joins are with hexagon one to hexagon two and hexagon two with hexagon one so we have to do 60 divided by two to get 30 which are the total hexagon to hexagon joins so we do 60 plus 30 giving us the total number of joins which is 90. Thanks guys for watching our video, please make sure to like, comment and subscribe and we'll see you in next time's video, bye!